Hello, Mayors. Welcome back to Build It with Smith. I am your host, Smith, and we're playing SimCity Build It today in the middle of restructuring my city, which is what we've been doing in the last couple of episodes. If you got time, you can check some of those out to see uh, where we were at. And, uh, of course, my city uh, was all put together a few episodes before that. So you can always go check that out if you want to see... Uh, what my population was, how the layout was, all that sort of stuff, you can look at it in past videos. Now, before I get started, I want to send a special shout out because I figured that I should spend this, send a special shout out to India. All of the folks in India, I see you have been coming, leaving nice comments, and I would just want to give a little bit of love, shout back to India, all of the folks in India that are watching. So, uh, what we want to do in this video here today is uh this is kind of like i've been saying i've been wanting to make kind of uh more of an island appeal maybe maybe not island maybe just more of water in here basically and so i want to have you know certain regions dedicate dedicated regions here that uh have water surrounding them and this is one of them and um so you, you can see i've got a cluster of buildings in here and these are mostly the epic buildings that you see, uh, it's not letting me click on them. It's saying speed up tokens. Uh, most of the epic buildings that you see here are in the. Here we go. They're in the. Um, well, that says entertainment, but they're mostly in the. Uh, what is it? The gambling. Mostly in the gambling categories. Most of these epic buildings here I got from the gambling categories. There's a couple from the entertainment, but most of them are from the category of gambling. So, I wanted to kind of take some time to beautify this thing and make it, make it look very cool. And so, um, I got a kind of road trick that I want to do here. And... I'll just move all the buildings out of the way that are going to be affected by this little road trick that I do. It's not really a trick, it's just something to help to beautify the road. Spread out the road a little bit, that way there's more distinction between the buildings. A lot of times, uh, the, the buildings are so tall that you can't really see and appreciate the buildings behind them if you know what I'm saying and so I kinda like to do this trick to help spread out the road a little bit and that way you can um, appreciate the other buildings by there and it, it just uh, really gives, gives a good defining road here and that's what we want to sort of concentrate on at least in this portion so uh, what we do with this it's very simple. I don't want to make it seem like I'm about to give rocket science here or anything, but it's very simple. All you do is you put two roads there, and then when we go to our parts, there's a particular park, the row of trees. And I have a lot of rows of trees. How many do I have? I have 18. Uh, because I've done this before, and I bought a lot. So anyway, uh, you just put them right up there. Now I remember at one point, let me just say this one point there used to be where when you would click a, a, a park for instance and then you go add to it and press this it would take you all the way back to the beginning here and I remember saying that that was a complaint of mine in a video and then all of a sudden they fixed it so I don't know I mean I know that EA watches my videos and whatnot but we very rarely see um, Oh, am I getting bit by an ant on my toe? Seemed like I was getting bit by an ant. Okay. Oh, dang it. I put them on the wrong side. All right. Yes. All right. We need to switch them over here. This is what I meant to do. Now, this is also going to help, as you can see, it helps to um, bring up the property value, or should I say the population of some of the buildings around there so I actually want yeah yeah so it does that so let's see looks like the most here 
is this one because it's grabbing all of them there and um, I believe that you should be able to move these buildings back now so let's look at our road so now we have a long defining road and I may want to even take this road all the way down I don't know maybe I will do that take it all the way down so let's just put these buildings back and um, the buildings is a whole nother thing I think I talked about this I mostly I've probably talked about this several times but and you may be tired of hearing it but uh, I don't want all of my buildings I want to mix the buildings up I want to have short buildings tall buildings all that sort of stuff because as I mentioned now working downtown I can see that that is more realistic now we'll delete this road here because we don't need well yeah we'll just say we don't need it and we'll just we'll just uh, can I move this and here comes the difficult part because I got to create all right so I guess I need to move all these over here I got to create now and I think it'll be okay when it's all said and done it will be okay there we go lots of building movings around all right and then so now we will add this road here and so we'll fill this in with more buildings today or maybe maybe we'll just move these over here what not and then we will not have a use for this outside road here I really don't want to see two roads only surrounding one row of buildings like this right here but oh, you can't see this this right here it doesn't make any sense so we can just now delete it and uh, like I said we'll probably add something like as we're beginning with this whole water thing we'll probably add uh, something there but anyway this is our layout right well this is this is our this is our uh, what should we call these our, our little cluster oh all right well we're a bit out of the zone with this it appears that our roads were pushed out a bit too far uh, but that's okay we can use the building somewhere else and we can do something else with all of that let's look at the other ones here because right, we'll have a lot of space for building so that won't be a problem we'll be able to take the good buildings out of here and put them and then we'll just have this extra row maybe it will be for our commercial buildings the just whatever buildings don't require um, anything you know we could put those there uh, and so bringing it back to that we, we what I want to do again like I said I want to these buildings is a problem because it's hiding a lot of beauty behind them you know don't you agree so with that being said I want to bring these two roads these two roads through here and then you know do something there with uh, all of that so uh, anyway we want to move some of these around now and okay so we'll do that and we'll just we'll just toss these buildings over. Let's just toss them over here just kind of get them out of the way that way we can be uh, free spirits with our creativity here and uh, I really wish there was a better way to to move buildings so many buildings when you got what do I have 183 buildings and 23 of which are abandoned so I guess that's my total though is 183 when you got that many buildings moving them all here and there and everywhere is kind of cumbersome and tedious but anyway uh, you know, we won't have to move all of them at once so how about the other regions how's everyone else doing 
with your different regions out there. I haven't really looked at my regions. I don't know if you guys want to take a quick look. You want to take a quick look at the other regions? We can do that. Let's see. So I've got the Green Valley, and it probably looks the same. Yes, yeah, because uh, a few videos back, I used this as a prop to show a layout here. So here's my layout that I used. You're kind of getting the behind the curtain look here. And so I made a video and um, I think it was about the services. If you want to go back and look at it, it was a, it was a video I made a couple months back about service layouts. And so all of these buildings are actually supported by uh, with this layout. All of the buildings. Isn't that amazing? So many buildings, right? But they're all all being supported by just this layout with these this triangle looking layout here. So isn't that cool? That's neat. Okay. Uh, on to something else. Oh yes. You wanted to see the other region. So I've only unlocked three and as you can see I can hardly keep up with it. Uh, so I think at one point I was going to change this around. So you're not missing much, folks, if you're wondering. Oh, man, do I want to put this? Let me move this. Let me just put this back because I'm sure I forgot about it. And I might want to use it in my main region there. So, yes, we have a mall, Crescent Shopping Mall. Let's put those back in the inventory there so that they don't get lost over here. Do I have anything else at the beach? No, I don't think so. I probably think that as far as the different regions that we've gotten so far, this is my favorite one. There's so much space. And I don't see... I mean, look at this. So much space here. And you can't forget the space on the beach. So... And what's this, like a lagoon here? They really did a good job with this layout. I'd be interested to see um, some of your some of your layouts, uh, especially for things like this. I think they'll be really nice. Okay, so yes, let's go back to my capital city. All right, so let's go ahead and we're going to bring out the roads here. Lordship. Okay, so we've got that, and in my opinion, I don't think we need this road right there. That's right. We're just going to bring them on through like this. Now, now we've created somewhat of a more open look. And I even want to utilize these spaces here for something. All right, so let's now, now let's look and see how we can make all of this work. So we'll go to our gambling category and we have, yeah, so I've got, if I wanted to, I can put just a bunch of casinos over here. We've got this, we've got that, we've got that. Oops, nope, I don't want to buy that again. We got that. And I'm sure there's more. Yeah, there's, there's like, there's, so they could all fit there if that's what we want to do. I'm kind of still, I don't know yet. You know, I don't know. So what I want to do, but, uh, oops, this one, that one right there. So, okay, so this is something, this is something, right? This is something that we could do. Just playing around here, seeing how it looks. And so that's one thing that we didn't do with this layout here is is is, is we didn't add any uh, specialization buildings, and that's very important because it saves the buildings number one, and then uh, number two, it um, you know just makes it look a little better. Um, we need to check one thing here. Put this over here. I think all these go together, right? You got, you got, what is this one? The Luxurious Casino, and I believe that's the tower for it. So, we'll just do it like that. And it's the tower. And what else? We have? The 
sweet casino. There is a tower there, a gambling house. All right, so these actually go together. Now I'd like to turn them, I believe. Probably go something like that. I'm not too sure. Do these, they appear that they should, do they connect? Okay, they probably go like that, right? That looks, I don't know how they connect. Or do they, maybe it's supposed to be like this. I'm sure some sort of way they're supposed to somewhat marry up a little bit better. And if you ever play the SimCity game, they actually do. You can build the towers on top of each other. All right, that works right there. And then we can just have this gambling house next to, or, or, or let's put the two tower buildings together. See, this is why, this is why my videos are like 30 minutes long. It could be longer because I spend time on things like this. Arranging buildings. All right, so there's that, and I'm sure that these probably be better suited All right, together. And there we go. Right there we go. Okay, so let's take a look. See. All right, so it's not too bad. Um. I guess the one thing that's bothering me here is I'd rather see these be in the back. How do we, there we go. That one. That. Okay, something like this-ish a little bit. Yeah, it just looks slightly better it looks like they kind of belong together that they're on the same parking lot or does it let me see I think okay more there we go so like that that's how it's supposed to go now with that being said does this one work the way that it's supposed to or should it be it should probably be like this see this is the entrance this is the entrance here okay and then all right so it's yeah okay so that's how they're supposed to go together I'm glad we figured that out. They're supposed to go like that. This is the entrance. You see, you come in, you turn, the unload or whatnot, and then here's your tower right there. And then, on this building, you come in. Uh, well, I don't see a place for you to pull up. But anyway, there's that. That's that. And then let's check on these just to make sure we have our sleek tower. And, I don't know, let's see ways can we turn this probably more like this it seems closer probably like that all right but there we go so now we've created this open space you know so that you can appreciate the buildings around it a little bit better I think that in particular works right over here with this one a lot better you see it looks more more balanced is what I'm trying to say okay so now what do we do with this space here well, we go to here and we're going to grab some more casino buildings. Now, let me just say this. If you don't already know, you may already know this, but these are some of my favorite buildings from the game. Oh, for sure. These are some of my favorites because uh, you'll go, you can go back, as a matter of fact. You can go back and you can see when... I first started playing the contest of mayors for these buildings and uh, oh, there's a couple, a couple I missed here a couple I miss so I guess those are for different deals so can I buy this how much do I have? oh I think I can oh oh yeah look at that guys just bought a new volcano casino that's pretty cool all right and there's a couple of others what can I do with them a couple of others a couple of other buildings there we go so this is now all the casino 
and all of those go together. Or well, it looks like they could. They all line up. They're all carefully defined, I should say. So I don't know what I'd do with that actually, because I could put I could put one right here. And I could do that. Right? Or. And then put another one behind it. Then. Let's see. Let's look at that. Let's just move these over here and explore some potential layouts. We could even. Worship. This it's just gonna be a lot of wasted space though on on some of the buildings. So let's see. This probably is not going to work the way I was envisioning it. Yeah, didn't. So I think what I was thinking is do something like that, and then you could put it over here. But there's a lot of wasted population. You're only getting 7,500 out of that one. So that's probably not the best. It probably looks good. But if we're trying to boost our population here, this is not the best deal. I'd like to. Let's see. Of course it looks good. I'm sure. You know. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. You got this little casino deal here. You got some nice casinos here. It's pretty cool. Yes. Um, but there is no place for anything else. So, um, it's just this one here. What can we do with him? Let's see. What can we do with him? Uh, could put that right over here. That wouldn't really do anything. Yes. All right. So... We'll have to think of something for that. Uh, but now we've kind of got it looking a little bit better here. Yeah, it does. It definitely looks more like a downtown. Now, what can we do with this space here? Now, here's another thing. We could actually fit that right there. Mm-hmm. We could fit it right there, this other casino. And then we just have to... We could either... We're gonna have to put some parts either right there, or if we move these aside. And we could do it like that. And put put a park, you know, any old park would work. Let's see, there's a lot of things we could use here. I'll just go for the sculpture garden, maybe the urban plaza right there. And then we could group it up with one of these here, the modern park, probably looks pretty cool. Or even the, uh, the plumb bob park, it's kind of an oldie but a goodie. That one looks cool. Uh, so, oops, I didn't choose anything. All right. Cool. Modern park right there just to give everybody an idea. So see that would work also. And uh, like I said, the problem is the population. We don't get a lot of the population with this current setup. And then we got to find a place for those. We could just kind of plug them in uh, anywhere. Let's put those in here like that. And then that would be that. So here we go. It looks a lot nicer. It looks a lot better. Let's get a picture. Uh, we wait till it's nighttime or it's getting to be that way. And imagine with all this water in the background, how nice that's going to look. I think it's going to look very nice. Mm-hmm. All the water there. All right, so it's getting to be darker. And let's see, there's a good angle for a picture. 
This one's pretty good. There you go. Right. Let's make sure we catch all the casinos in there. It's pretty good. All right. So there's that. Okay. So well, I feel like um, this is coming toward the end of the video uh, because what we've done here is we've created some things but some things are still open um we want to figure out what to do with these buildings um right now we've got our fire stations and our services taking up a big slot there which would actually serve this pretty well now the thing with that is we could al also use our uh Max's Manor would also work. I'm just trying to see what would that all capture. If we put it right here, it would be capturing everything. And then we could kind of have our layout a little bit. Let's see. Put it But the thing with this other one is, let's see, I think that we have coverage except for that side there. So, I don't know. It's something to think about. I'm not going to bore you here with all that. And then, so, like I said, I think a lot of this portion right here will be water. And so, I think it'll look pretty nice. Now, all this, these are just buildings that I placed just to get them the heck out of the way. But um, we're also not too far removed from... Um, having this set up as well you know as kind of a beach I think having this road in here separating just one line of buildings is pretty nice too it'll look like a pretty nice beach once you have all the epic buildings in here all the epic beach buildings that is in here and I think it'll look pretty nice we've even got some of these green uh, green uh, what is it green valley buildings in here and that'll look pretty nice as well uh, so anyway a lot to figure out a lot more buildings that need spaces and uh, I'm sure it's gonna be looking pretty nice uh, but anyway I think that my brain is fried now and we're going to put a stop to this video and end it right here tell everyone everybody thanks for watching again leave comments let me know what you thought about the video if you have any questions in general about SimCity, let me know that too. And that's all. Peace out. See you next time.